Hey guys, since like we have some more information about iOS 5 or it's actually about two solid sources that is saying that we're probably not going to see iOS 5 until the fall comes and the reason behind this seems to be because okay first of all we didn't see any discussions or that Apple talked about iOS 5 on this iPad 2 event that they had here in the beginning of March and then also we have heard rumors about that Apple may have a little April event where they would talk would talk about iOS 5 and the mobile me service but it doesn't seem like that's going to be the case this year and that's going to be kind of interesting because that basically means that uh, Apple is going to break their little thing that they usually launch a big iOS update in the spring so that they're moving into the fall this year at least this year may launch it yeah this year fall and some things that we seems to be knowing right now is first of all iOS 5 this fall and also you know I know it's it's a long 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 time until we get to get there but the rumors are also saying that it's going to be a major revamp of the OS and that would be kind of cool I mean the OS hasn't uh, the iOS hasn't changed that much since 2007 they haven't made like any like seriously major revamps of the OS and also that we may see iOS 5 like getting a preview on the WWDC in June where we're probably also going to see Apple talk about the new iPhone 5 and probably release it a little after that and also we heard these rumors that the iOS 5 will may launch in fall with the new rumored iPad 3 so yeah the rumors about the iPad 3 they are still you know we may see a new iPad I'm, I'm really going to be happy if we're going to see an iPad 3 this year that would really spice things up and this would be kind of cool because that means that Apple would change so in every fall we would get new Apple Touches and we would get new iPads and it's just weird to launch something in the spring but it's still kind of cool that you launch something during the spring and during the summer the iPhone and then during the fall you get the new Apple Touches also what we have heard rumors about this new iOS is that will be more about the cloud so we may see Apple launch some more music services or something like that that you use the cloud more you know you use the web to store your more of your stuff online and that's going to be kind of exciting so Mac OS 10 line is still expected to come this summer so this year could be pretty awesome and I'm, I'm mostly looking forward to that major revamp of the OS because I really think that they need to do something about the OS I mean it, it's still awesome but it would be nice if they added some cool features so we at least could be a little more like the Android because Android it's awesome but it lags but yeah still it's awesome so yeah see you.